In our BT, Brahmacharya training, 2009-10, uh, 12 years back, we had uh, the privilege of having a fixed schedule. Okay. So in those days, our study time, at least my study time was 4.20 a.m. to 5 a.m. Plus, afternoon, we didn't have much schedule after lunch. Around 1 o'clock till, till 2.30, we had some gap. Then 2.30 to 4.30, some service is there. Sometimes that service is also not there. Then the gap will become 1.30, 1 o'clock to 2.30, uh, 4.30 like that. So our general study time, in those days, my study time was 4.20 a.m. to 5 a.m. plus 1 to 2.30 minimum or 1 to whatever, 4 or that much time. Every day we had minimum one and a half to two hours we used to squeeze out time to read in those days. But when we completed the training phase, then we got into schedules of different services, different devotees are doing different responsibilities. So I could never find out that much time. Now what I did, whenever I get a married, whenever time I get, whatever time I get beyond my allocated services, I would just read. It could be 9.30 to 9.40 p.m. It could be whatever, 6 to uh, you know, 7 a.m. So when you get up a little early, before Mangalati you chant 80 rounds, after Mangalati you chant 8 more rounds, then till Darshanati time is there for us, half an hour, 45 minutes, one hour, I would read at that time. So like that I read whenever I got some time. And whenever I got more time, I read 7 hours, 8 hours, 10 hours. So one, at one phase of my life I was extremely sick, just sitting in the sick room only for like several months. So, uh, no other engagement, physically I can't do much. So I would just lie down and then read Bhagavatam, hours together. Night time, headache, I would just get up at 12 o'clock or 1 o'clock when I could not sleep. Open Bhagavatam, just read. I did like that. So, we should be like camel. You, you know camel? <laughs> so camel, when it is traveling in the desert, the camel may not get water whenever it wants. So whenever there is an opportunity, camel would just drink as much water as possible. Next two days or three days in this uh, deserts, camel will not get any time. They will not get opportunity to drink water. That water will, will keep the camel survive. Right? So we should be like that. Whenever we get some time, let's read. And on a regular basis, we can keep some study hour, if it is practical in our thing. But, uh, uh, but whenever we get time, if we just start charging our spiritual batteries by reading Shastra, that will protect us uh, in phases that are very busy, although we don't get to study. It's like uh, you're traveling, you're going for a long journey. You keep your battery, phone battery charger 100%. Okay? Because I can't uh, charge my battery throughout my travel. Uh, so like that, we need to plan. In my case, I just mentioned. <laughs> Whatever time I got, I just read. Now also I do that only. I, there is no specific time allocated for my reading or writing. Whatever time I got, I just keep doing it. Before coming here, there was half an hour break. I just worked on three, four verses of Brahma Mohanlila. <laughs> Tenth canter Subodhani. Yesterday was the 15th verse, right? Today I came to 26th verse. Okay, ten verses happened in this one day. <laughs> That's all we can do. <laughs> okay. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama.